the showstopper, the sh best match at Beat the Streets, uh, maybe not the best match, but the biggest match was Ben Askren versus Jordan Burroughs. So this was a very hyped up match. You know, you have a guy coming in from US UFC who is a national champion, and then you have a guy who is another national champion, Olympic champion, world champion, and Jordan Burroughs. Two guys who are like the epitome, the best at the top at each of their sports. They're coming in and they're wrestling each other at a charity event, Beat the Streets. So did this live up to the hype? Well, you know, I I think it it did. It was a little bit of a, I don't want to say it was a letdown, but the thing is, you know, with Burroughs and Askren and you know freestyle it was it was a quick match compared to the match before that Yanni versus Punia which was you know a little bit more exciting because it was actually a whole match you had Burroughs and Askren where Burroughs really just took it to him right Burroughs blast doubled Askren into another dimension it was absolutely wild and I think that this match was so hyped up uh because these guys were they were jabbing each other on Twitter and social media for a few weeks, a few months, and they were just trying to, you know, I wondered how much of that was real uh, because, you know, Askren is a showman, and I know that he has that angry side to him, but he's also, he's a really nice guy, and so is Burroughs. I mean, I can't really see Burroughs trash talking that much uh, in real life, but in on social media, it really leveled up the event. And, you know, as soon as you get out there, you see Askren whispering something to Burroughs, and he just said, uh, in the interview after, he said, he whispered to Burroughs, like, can you believe we're out here wrestling at Madison Square Garden right now at Beat the Streets? Like, come on. And Burroughs really didn't give him any response, um, but he just kept wrestling because in Burroughs' post-match interview, he said, look, I'm out here to do this for my family. I can't let up, not even for a second, because Askren asked him, like, he's like, I thought you were taking it easy on me. But yeah, he ended up picking him up and blast double on Askren because I asked you guys, actually, on my channel, I said, what do you think is most likely to happen? And I said, what, what happens most likely? Will Askren funk Jordan Burroughs? Will Jordan Burroughs blast double Askren? Will JB pin Askren? Or will Askren attempt to fight JB? And and I didn't think that last one would happen at all. Uh, but you guys all said that JB would blast Askren into another dimension. And that's exactly what happened. It was really a fun match. And I think it grew the sport. Uh, it, it got people that were interested in UFC. Interested in wrestling a little bit, I think. And you see that with Dana White, who now, uh, you know, him and Askren have had a big you know feud going on over the last couple of years because Ashman wanted to fight UFC well now he's there and now White is saying who is a leader of the UFC he's saying that Burroughs he wants him to fight in the UFC and as you know you know him and Burroughs and Shale had that little jabs at each other a couple weeks ago and I really don't know if Burroughs should fight UFC maybe when he's done wrestling but right now he's doing so well in wrestling, why do you want to? Why do you want to risk his face, you know, and, and get and get beat up like that? So that was a pretty awesome match. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments below. Did this live up to the hype?